I have faith in our courts of law. We have competent men and women in our judiciary who I believe will uphold the Constitution, protect it with their zeal, and always uphold and protect the will of the Kenyan people. Article 1 of the Constitution says the sovereignty of this country rests with the people. And the institutions like Parliament and Senate exercise that power as a matter of delegation so that we have a good country of rule of law as opposed to the state of nature. I appeal to all our independent institutions to uphold the rule of law and remain true to the Constitution so that we don't get in situations where we can have a country that feels that the rule of the jungle is in application. So far, it is my observation that we have a very patriotic judiciary, a judiciary that upholds the rule of law and the Constitution and always upholds the supremacy of our Constitution. And I believe that Kenya will be a country of the rule of law. Deputy President Erigadi Gashagwa has named a team of a competent lawyers who will stand with him and who are ready to fight and deal the end. Remember that he has assembled a very well trained lawyers all. Ya wenye watakuwa wanakikisha that uh, the DP wins uh, this uh, case. Na ukiangalia vizuri pale tuko na sama of the lawyers who are on top of the list. We have uh, Paul uh, Mwite, we have uh, Victor uh, Swanya, we have uh, Lisha Ongoya, uh, George uh, Sakimba, Ndegwa Jiro, we have uh, Willis Otieno, Amos Kisilo, uh, Faith Waingwa, uh, George uh, Wandate. Na ukiangalia tu e list, e list ni mzuri sana, ama ni list ya wase tu wa kofiti sana when it comes uh, to uh, matters a uh, law. Now, uh, next week, now we are waiting the Senate uh, proceed on uh, this uh, case and uh, Rigadi Gashiagwa will have uh, to defend himself in Senate for hours as uh, Sakaja uh, is set to, to testify against him uh, during the period. Gashiagwa uh, lawyers will also have a chance to call uh, witnesses to uh, the stand who uh, he believes will help to save uh, his uh, job. His legal team says they have uh, several witnesses lined up of which they haven't uh, uh, disclosed uh, their names. So uh, many Kenyans are waiting to see how these uh, proceedings will go. Yeah, remember that uh, Tumiona that uh, Itafanyo and uh, Plenary, of which we know that uh, Senator Aaron Cheriot had proposed that a special committee be formed to investigate the deputy president. Yeah, but uh, Nairobi uh, Senator Edwin Sifuna refused to, to second the motion, prompting a directive from the speaker who is a uh, Amazon uh, king that uh, he issue ama e uh, investigation it has kizwa under the will uh, senate in that uh, the all the senators will have uh, to listen uh, to this case then after that uh, they will come up with the final uh, decision now if the dp is uh, uh, impeached ama uh, if what uh, sema that uh, are impeached then uh, you will also have another chance uh, to proceed to the court if uh, you, you will be willing to ama to uh, decide not to but uh, there is a chances that uh, at a proceed to the court if the senate uh, impeaches uh, him so to me know that uh, Apokwa Indro at the DP has said that they have a faith in our court. So what does that mean? That means that in case the Senate supports this impeachment, the him and the team will proceed to the courts. Then after that, the courts will also come with a decision. 
Ya yeah, remember uh, during the 2022 election uh, Azimio walienda to the courts then after that uh, the courts uh, walili lie on ama walieza to go with the side of Kenya Kwanza. Yana yeah, Kenya Kwanza walifikia ku win uh, that uh, case and that's why Rigadi Gashiagwa is saying that uh, he knows uh, he will emerge uh, victorious and uh, that's what uh, many Kenyans are hoping uh, to see. Now this is a very serious kind of impeachment uh, in that uh, for the first time a deputy president uh, will be facing uh, this uh, kind of uh, impeachment. Yana wa Kenya wengi wamekuwa tu wamezoea tu impeachment ya governors and uh, deputy uh, governors. Uh, but for the first time so to know that a uh, uh, sitting Deputy a uh, president is uh, facing a very serious uh, kind of uh, impeachment. Yeah, and which is a very kind of a serious uh, political uh, change when it comes uh, to our uh, politics. Kuona uh, a sitting ama deputy president aki face this uh, kind of impeachment is not a joke. Now, to me, one that uh, uh, Senate uh, Speaker uh, Amazon Kingi am issue and directive to all senators not to travel uh, outside uh, Kenya because of this uh, impeachment. Uh, that shows how serious uh, this uh, impeachment is. Uh, that's why an attack kila senator akue apo asikize then a contribute so that they can come up with a fair judgment now at the parliament side we love to come up with their evidence and Rigadi Gashagwa will love to defend himself then after that the senators will have to fought whether to support the impeachment or to acquit the deputy president now to corner this kind of a serious issue whereby if the deputy president is impeached this it's quite difficult for him to run for any a political seat in the near future. And remember that Rigadi Gashagwa has a very bright uh, future when it comes uh, to Kenyan politics. Yeah, na za kuwa tuna ile tamania uh, ku run for a uh, president one day, ku run for governor, ama to even member of parliament. But after impeachment, it's quite a very kind of a uh, different uh, story. But uh, akialawiwa tu kuendelea kama deputy president, it will be safer on uh, his side. And that's why unawana tu wana try his best to fight back so that uh, he can and win uh, this uh, case. Now, on uh, uh, his uh, defense, uh, his team uh, will measure uh, most on uh, this uh, public participation. Nyetuliona ilifanywa on Friday na pia on Saturday. So, watatumia iyo kama win credit uh, on uh, their side in that uh, ilifanywa on a uh, weekend uh, Friday then ika rudi nikafanywa on Saturday pia ilikuwa urgent na pia tumeona wa Kenya wengine wametokea that wakasema wako involved uh, fully in that kukuwa enough uh, time for them uh, to uh, come up uh, with their opinion so uh, it me regarding Gashagwa uh, itakuwa tuna kazi mingi sana ya ku defend him but we hope that uh, they will see a breakthrough uh, after now all the eyes are now uh, focusing on uh, the Senate uh, come uh, next uh, week where now we will be uh, following all these uh, proceedings live as Kenyans will be eagerly awaiting to see uh, the fate of uh, their deputy uh, president. Anyway, thank you for watching. Subscribe, like our channel so that uh, we can keep on growing together as a community. See you in the next video. Bye bye. I'm out.